Now tonight marks the start of a special week-long event on RT1, big week on the farm, broadcasting live every single evening mm -hmm. in one of the busiest weeks, of course, in the farming calendar. Our reporter, Colm Flynn, joins us live now from Farm HQ in County Westmead. Colm, it is a very busy week on the farm for you. You said it, Dahi. It's going to be a very busy week, but a fun week. Welcome to County Westmeath and to John Fagan's sheep and cattle farm. But no ordinary farm, because like you said, this is going to be big week on the farm. This barn has been transformed into a HD studio. And here's the man who owns the farm. It's John Fagan. John, how are you? Good, good, good. I have to ask you, who is this you have here? This is a pet lamb and his name is Dahi. It's OK, <laughs> Dahi. There you go. Just and for today. Just for today. How old is Dahi? He's about three weeks old. This is such a busy time for you, isn't it? Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. We've been uh, flat out lambing here for the last month and we're coming towards the end of it now. So, And I mean, out of all the time we could do this uh, throughout the year to come for the circus or for the show to come at this time, it must be just madness. Yeah, it's, it's great. It's a great bit of fun and we're really enjoying it. And it's good to have everybody here and share kind of the work that we do in the farm with the wider audience, you know. This is the farm that you grew up on, so tell me a bit about it. Yeah, I was, I, I was born here and I've been farming here in my own right for about 15 years. And uh, it's a family farm and it's, uh, it's, uh, it's just what we do. It's just it's been a real challenge uh, for me over the last few years to get it going. But I've built the flock up to about a thousand <coughs> euros. And... <laughs> what was that? What did you say? You're having he's fun. Like, he's he's, he's having looking fun. forward to the show tonight. So, I mean, we've turned this into a TV studio and people will see it tonight at 7 o'clock, but what would you normally see in this barn? Um, well, about a week ago, this place was full of sheep and we were busy just with the O's lambing and uh, they're all in individual pens and things like that, so we cleared it out just for the show. And the rest of them are down in another shed just down the other end of the yard. So. And hundreds and hundreds of birds so far? Yeah, yeah, I'd say we've got over a thousand sheep wow. or lambs born already, so mm -hmm. another about two or three hundred to go. So. You were saying that you were up until three o'clock in the morning last night? Yeah, yeah, we had a busy night last night. We had seven, sheep bo or seven lambs born there this morning as well, so it's, it's business as usual for us amidst all the madness that's going on as well, you know? So we're going to be having a lot of fun on the show because, you know, there'll be a lot of entertaining pieces in it, but what is the aim of the programme overall? Well, the aim is just to... Have, uh, have a showcase of what happens on farms in the spring from yo's lambing uh, to cows calving, mares foaling and also to show the wildlife that exists on the farm at the same time and the interaction of farming and the wildlife. Mm -hmm. Okay well great we'll let you and Dahi get back to it and prepare Cheers. for nice tonight fun. and uh, among a lot of the stuff that we're doing on the show one of them uh, if we do get it it'll be quite cool a new world record we are trying to set a Guinness world record for sheep shearing this is the man who'll be doing it Ivan Scott how are you? Good thanks. Good Letter thanks. Kenny man? Yeah, up there anyway, yeah, Donegal. So tell me, the, what is the aim tonight? What will you be aiming to do? I'll be aiming to break a Guinness World Record by shearing one sheep. What is the current time? The current record is 39.31 seconds. Wow, okay. So, so, I mean, can I ask you what your best time to date has been? I'll keep it a secret for now. Keep it a secret, we yeah. have to find out. But you were telling me beforehand that now, this time of the year is not really the best time to try and set a world record like this. It's not ideal. Um, usually... A lot of the sheep are shorn around the 1st of June onwards, so we're like a few weeks early and it's difficult to get enough wool on them this early out, so we're here now, so we'll have a go. Yeah, there's no going back now. No, <laughs> yeah. too late. Now, we were meant to have a sheep here, but let's pretend for the sake of television that we have a beautiful sheep here and we're petting it. So uh, what's the technique? What do you do? Is there a certain trick to it? There is a technique, yeah, which takes good few years to master as a professional and yeah it might look easy but it's really physical but you're a bit of a dab hand at it because I'm told that you have a world record currently yeah I currently, boast. <laughs> what is it I currently hold the uh, lamb record I show 744 lambs in eight hours wow. I set that in New Zealand in 2012 so yeah so tonight's going to be your second world record We'll see. We'll see. Well, the man who will be looking over uh, everything to make sure that everything is done properly is from Glenn from the Guinness Book of Records. Uh, you came over today from the UK. I did, yeah. I'm an official adjudicator from the Guinness World Records. Yeah. So are you constantly just travelling around the world going to different things like this? Pretty much, yeah, to all kinds of manner of uh, attempts at Guinness World Record titles, yeah. 
And I know that we're having a bit of fun here tonight with this, but it's serious business. So what are the rules and regulations around this? Well, for this particular record attempt, which is the fastest time to shear one sheep, uh, first and foremost, they have to conform to World Shearing Committee rules and in the presence of an expert in the field of sheep shearing. Uh, on top of that, the sheep has to be older than 18 months old and I will have to produce a minimum of three kilograms of wool from the shear. OK, so you think he'll do it? Uh, he's got a good chance. He's, uh, I understand he's been warming up, practising, and he's certainly very fit. And let's have a look over here before we go back to you guys in the studio. Tonight, this will be packed with people. We'll have celebrity guests. We'll be doing the sheep shearing, obviously. Look at all our beautiful crew. Let's say hello to them. Say hello, everybody. Give us a nice wave there. They're shy in the background. But we're going to be taking this farm live to the nation for the next five nights on RT1. So don't forget, Big Week on the Farm kicks off tonight, 7 p.m. We'll have another exclusive on the Today Show at 5 p.m. tomorrow. But until then, it's goodbye from the farm.